put, Stanford University is a whole new world to explore. But with so many resources at students' fingertips, sometimes it's hard to make sure you know all of the lesser known gems on Stanford's campus. So in this video, we have you covered. From clandestine coves to sensational study spots, we have all the deets. So keep watching if you want to learn all of the finesses across Stanford's campus so you can better equip yourself to navigate the farm in the fall. Welcome to Green Library. This library houses the Department of Special Collections. The Special Collections is pretty cool. They have a lot of interesting finds, many of which are one of a kind that you really can't find anywhere else. For example, in the Special Collections Department, you can find the original Star Wars manuscript, complete with hand notes from George Lucas. See what else you can find in there. Welcome to the Media and Microtech Center in the basement of Green Library. It's one of my favorite places to come hang out after a long day of work or a long day of school. They have tons of consoles, video games, DVDs for you to use during your time here at Stanford. I come down here and I'll play on some consoles after having a long day of classes, or I'll hang out with friends. It's one of my favorite places on Stanford's campus. No, the library is huge. I know. Oh, no. Huh. Oh, it's only 1 p.m. Uh, 5 p.m. Monday through Friday. Guess you'll have to visit when you come to Stanford in the fall. Hello and welcome to the roof of McMurtry. This is an amazing building that not only has great places for you to sit and eat with your friends or study, but it also has an amazing unparalleled view of campus. But all in all, this building really just allows me to reflect on things I'm doing. It allows me to study in a really quiet place, and I love to come here at night and just enjoy the night views. Yet another scintillating Stanford secret is the Bender Room on the fifth floor of Green Library. This is a perfect place to come when you want to study quietly or cram out that last minute essay that's due tomorrow. Especially when the sun is setting behind the main quad, the Bender Room is the perfect place to be. Hello, welcome to the Law and Terrace. This is a phenomenal place to study here on campus. It's accentuated with just beautiful trees, um, a waterfall over there that's like this peaceful kind of background noise when you're studying, and it's just surrounded by a lot of greenery, which I think is so fascinating and a really serene place to kind of sit down and get some work done. 